Hey guys, Rob Mitchell here. Thanks for joining me. Um, I'm doing this um, uh, video today on the uh, Trap Trader Oscillator. And I'm gonna show you some of the patterns that we use. I've been using this for seven years. I've never actually done a specific uh, video on it. Yeah. And so but there are tons of patterns on this thing and I think you're gonna really enjoy them. So I'm gonna do any number of them. Today I'm gonna do a three, uh, 3D order flow secrets, yeah, for day trading. And um, so let's uh, let's take a look, yeah. Uh, day trading 3D order flow secrets using the Trap Trader Oscillator for order flow traps and momentum plays. Yeah, differences that make a difference. Yeah, we use these in the oil trading room and the stock index trading room, and uh, th this particular tool is available on Indicator Smart. But you can use the concepts that I cover in here on any indicators if you want to. No reason to do that, though. We've uh, been working this out over tens of thousands of hours and development. So uh, let me show you some of these uh, patterns. Yeah, past performance is not necessarily indicative of future results. There's a risk of loss trading futures. Don't use the grocery money for trading. Yeah. Um, so some uh, key concepts before we go uh, look at uh, charts. Yeah. Uh, trap trader oscillators, powerful order flow trapping and order flow momentum indicator. Order flow trapping is when traders have sold when they shouldn't have. And they get trapped on the wrong side. And the other one is where traders are thrown in the towel and it propels the market in your direction with strong order flow. And in the best case, it's where all hands on deck uh, kind of situation where everybody's on the same side and there's a vast majority, you know, 75 plus percent buyers or 75 plus percent sellers. Yeah. And so these are the kinds of things. Now, when I first started, or when I first developed this tool seven, eight years ago, um, uh, there were order flow tools that have like ladders and things like that. It puts a huge amount of data on your screen. So I don't want to spend a lot of energy um, uh, tracking an indicator. I want it to be the absolute minimum amount. Yeah. I want to uh, put my attention to my uh, trading. I want to put my attention to my lifestyle, not to being overwhelmed while I'm trading. Super important point there. Yeah. So uh, this tool, like I said, I started developing this about eight years ago. Uh, I checked it over the weekend. I was like, wow, I've been using this thing for seven years. I've never even done an individual video on it, which is crazy. Yeah. So here's the first one, 3D pattern I'm going to show you. Okay. Uh, when I counted up the number of hours, I use this for five and a half hours a day. And a lot of times on the uh, weekends and everything else, I'm using it even more. There's a, there's at least 10,000 hours and then hundreds of traders using this also. Yeah. And giving me feedback. Yeah. There's a um, new release. It'll be coming out fifth generation of development. Yeah. So it shows order flow trade setups by shape and not by a bunch of numbers on your screen. Yeah. So if you can learn some, if you can identify like triangles, yeah, and different kinds of triangles, yeah, triangles being tested, triangles going in a certain direction. The one I'm going to show today, 3D is like a, a triangle pattern of, of three triangles. Yeah. So it's real easy to see the amount of effort it takes is minimal. Yeah. So this enables you to be fast and not have to over process to find good signals. Yeah, you, know, you want to have, you don't want to be an overload while you're trading, right? So the other cool thing about this uh, is that the trade set up sequentially. So things happen before the trade setup happens. So you know what's happening and so you can anticipate the signal. And uh, we'll see that in a minute, yeah. So there's a bunch of different modes of operation in this tool. Um, there's probably close to a hundred different setups. I don't even try to count them anymore. Yeah. That we've developed over these seven years. And in this video, I'm going to show you, um, I'm going to show you one that we call the 3D pattern. And I think you're going to like it. The 3D pattern, uh, also known as three dots. Yeah. This is one of our uh, early patterns that we developed with the tool. And we've been using it all these years. Yeah. So you simply look for three dots on the chart. We'll see it in a minute. 
Okay. And in order to get a three dot pattern, you're first going to have two dots. And then if the oscillator stays inside and you reverse again, you get three dots. So you know it's happening way before it happens. This thing that I'm talking to you about, it sequencing, that's a super big deal because you know in advance that it's happening. Yeah. I like to do these with a trend. Yeah. Um, the one I'm going to show you today in crude oil. Um, but uh, this work on any reasonably volatile market. I could have done it on the ES. It just so happened I had this chart in front of me. Yeah. And so um, I'll show you a few variations on the pattern in the video also. All right. And uh, be sure to subscribe to this video. Subscribe right now. And if you like the video, like it. That tells other people to see it so that we can um, get this stuff out there. Yeah. Oh, um, I don't do a lot of marketing for these things. You know, like I said, this is the first video I've done on this in seven years of using it. And so um, the videos that I'm going to be doing in this series, I'm going to create a channel for this, for the Trap Trader Oscillator. But the videos I'm going to be doing in this have years and years and years of uh, knowledge behind them you know, and wisdom. You know, so... Um, so yeah, you can use this pattern on other tools, sure. Yeah, but we've refined it on this one. That's what I'm gonna show you uh, today. So um, here's a chart, you know, uh, let me go back to the beginning of the day. I just uh, marked some of these in advance so that we didn't spend a lot of time on this video. So what you're gonna see first is you're gonna see two dots. Now you're gonna see two dots. This is a trap trader oscillator, this guy right here. Yeah, now there are these needles and things like that. We're not covering that today, we're just covering these big dots, the big green dots, the big red dots, the big ones. Yeah, super easy to see. Big dot, big dot. Once I got big dot, as long as that one doesn't get broken, if I reverse again, this is the way I designed this uh, oscillator is it's locked to the price, okay? It's locked to the structure. Structure is a whole uh, different thing. We teach this in our trading rooms, okay? Um, which is something that you really uh, probably want to learn to do at some point if you're really going to take your trading seriously. But first, you're going to see two dots. As long as that's that dot right there, the second dot's not broken. Then when it reverses, as it does right there, you end up getting three dots. Okay. I'm only marking three dots on this chart. So I had my two. I got my three. And it's a buy. Yeah, especially a buy if the background is green and we're using this smart price band. If it's white, we're buying. If it's black, we're selling. Okay, got it. Super simple, smart price band. White buy, black sell, three higher dots. Now, if I've got already three higher dots and I get another three higher dots and I've got another three higher dots, but I only take it as three higher dots, I could call that four higher dots, but I don't bother. So it's three higher dots again. Okay, so well, that's another buy right there. It's another buy. The right edge got broken here, so the pattern's been broken. You know, pattern's been broken. It's no longer three dots. Then what do I get? I get two dots. You know, but we're only marking three dots, and that right edge isn't broken, and so this turns into what? Three dots. This guy's black. Well, three dots. Sell it. Yeah, there's another one. Three dots again, sell it. You know, super simple, happens sequentially in time. So you can see it before it's happening. See how these dots are all going in the wrong direction for the white smart price band? You know, see that? Okay, what happens over here? Man, we got this consolidation thing going on over here. Usually if I get that, I will not respect those. I will not but technically that'd be a trade. However, if you're doing it on back-to-back -back reversals like that, red, green, red, green, red, green, like that, I usually wait for it to break and then catch the next one. Those are three dots right there, buy it. That still would have been good, but it's better to uh, stay away from those. There's also other things that we knew. I did a video over the weekend on, on market mapping. Uh, haven't done a lot of videos on any of these kinds of things. And uh, with the market mapping, we knew the market's going higher today. You know? And so this just did it. And then I've got another three dots again. A lot of times you'll get them in sequence. So you get three dots, three dots, three dots, break. 
Yeah. Three dots, three dots, three dots, break. Yeah, you'll see that pattern over and over and over again. Okay, two lower dots, yeah, two or lower dots. The right edge wasn't broken. You got three lower dots right there. However, this hadn't changed yet. Now you kind of could have anticipated that, but um, that's not what we're marking here. We're marking these mechanically. We got three, uh, three lower dots again, and that's a cell and you get nailed on that. Why did you get nailed on that? Well, we knew the market's going up, yeah. But this is the mechanical signal, so that's sell, yeah. This is another pattern I'll cover in another video, but uh, when you get a, um, a, a V or a triangle like that, um, when you get a triangle like that, it immediately, this is immediately wrong, then you can omit that, you can. And if you do that, this is another pattern actually that I'll, like I said, I'll cover it in another video. But when you get this uh, V happening like that on a pattern like that, you can pretend that didn't happen. Just like I could pretend that these didn't happen where I'm getting it on all these back-to-backs. That's kind of what I was saying there. But this is even a stronger case of it. I can omit that out. And in that case, I get two higher dots that morphs into the three higher dots. You know, morphs into the three higher dots. And we're only marking three dot patterns here. And so this is a buy. Smart price band's white. That's the buy. You know? And then it does it again. Three higher dots morphs into three higher Dots again, and that one doesn't follow through so much. And then the uh, smart price band turns black, start market starts coming down. Yeah. Now I could say other things about what was going on here uh, at that time, but um, that's not really what we're doing here. So I won't, you know, there's all kinds of things that I told us what was going on over there. Uh, came down here, bottomed out, market started heading higher. It V'd higher, uh, taking out that uh, high right there, all in one run, yeah. Um, you could technically do three dot patterns on this run right here, but I'm not covering that in this video. I can show you how to do that with the needles. Yeah, but, 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 you know, but that's another story. Uh, these are three higher dots if you wanted to, but we're not doing those in this video. So a uh, smart, um, smart price band came up, started rolling over two lower dots followed by another lower dot, and you can sell that. And then the three lower dots turns into three lower dots again. Smart price band is black. You can sell that. You, know, you broke the right edge. Pattern is completed. Okay. And then um, in K period, usually we know a bunch of stuff about K period. It usually takes out H period. And so um, that would have been expected there. Yeah. And so... Uh, you get this back-to-back -back, uh, red, green, red, green thing again, and you can filter this out and call that three, uh, two higher dots or three higher dots uh, morphs into um, a three higher dot on um, this back-to-back -back thing. Because you know it's going higher, you could buy it. You don't, we don't have to have that on there, yeah. but um, just saying. And then you pick it up again, um, three higher dots uh, into the close. Yeah. So I mentioned uh, before I'd show you some little themes and variations on it. Uh, you could just also just do them strictly with smart price band or any number of other themes or variations. Indicator smart shows you a whole bunch of ways you can put trading systems together. So if that is something that you're interested in, uh, I would recommend that you go uh, take a peek at that. Yeah. Just reading over the site and how you can combine different kinds of tools together to make trading systems that will work, even if you don't. No, you know, like I've been doing this for over 30 years. Um, but what I'm showing you there is how to build trading systems that can work without having 30 years of experience to do it. So, um, so when we uh, put all these signals together, this is a, uh, for crude oil, Smart Super Renko 5, that's a bar type that we're using, 510. And it's a three dot pattern, yeah. I have a, uh, this is trade markers. Yeah, we use this for testing these kinds of things. Now we've been doing this pattern forever. Do I need to test this? This is a very normal kind of result uh, for, for this. 
about 90 um, 92 percent yeah that's a pretty normal result for this uh, for trending yeah trade three contracts five ten twenty uh, go to a break even after uh, five ticks 16 uh, tick stop loss and um, that returns about uh, 1308 on the day 1308 on the day if you went back and you tested this on other days um, you'd probably get a similar result you can always go on our um, uh, oil trading room. Um, we've got charts that are posted all the way back to 2014, and you can go, um, you can go look at those charts and uh, look at the these patterns also if you want. So, uh, so that's uh, that's the pattern. Yeah, that's the pattern. So uh, let's take a look at the other things I wanted to share with you here. Yeah. So. Um, more 3D concepts here. If you like this indicator, uh, you're gonna wanna get it soon before the price goes up. I'm not real big on pushing people into buying things, but if you're looking for a trading tool that is highly developed with known results, it has tons of patterns on it, you will never outgrow this indicator. Um, yeah. So we're adding some features soon that I haven't shown you in this video. Um, that effectively triple the capabilities. Yeah. So this tool is available at Indicator Smart and it's used daily in the stock index trading room. And Steve runs the stock index trading room, all kinds of patterns on this indicator. And um, I teach in the oil trading room daily using this indicator as a very main component of that. Yeah. This is a super go-to kind of indicator. And like I said, if you want to learn more um, about these kinds of patterns and how to put together trading systems like the one I'm showing you here, uh, go to Indicator Smart and check that out. Yeah, so be sure to subscribe. Thanks for joining me on this video, guys. Thank you. And we'll see you on the next one.